to another trumpet lesson. This time we're going to be going over how to play Jocelyn Flores. But also, I just wanted to make sure that you all knew that if you want to get a Trumpet Guy shirt or any type of my merch uh, before Christmas, then make sure you get it soon. And make sure you use the code DUTE on exit because you'll get 20% off your entire order. Now let's do it and get started. All right, so here we go. So as always, if you want to follow along with the music and make sure that you can see everything and how it fits together, then you can get the sheet music in the link down in the description below. Okay, so this song is actually very repetitive. It's basically only three parts that are repeated through the whole song. The first part, which I'm going to go over right now, is repeated five times in a row. This starts off with D, E, F, C, A, C, E, D, C, D, E, F, E, C, A, C, E, D, E, A, G, F, E. And that last little part just goes right back into the beginning again. And so, as I have it written in the sheet music, it's in eighth notes. Um, but you can kind of just play around with it, as you can hear in the song. So generally, I play them longer than eighth notes. That's just how they're written. And that goes like this. <laughs> So as you heard, I just went right back into the first part again. So yeah, that's repeated five times. And after those five times, um, that last lick of the line goes right into the next part, which starts like this. We have D, then A, G, F, E, 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 F, E, F, E, G, A, G, C, C, F, G A G A G F E F E and then A G F E. So as you can see that last little bit is the exact same as the last um, like notes of that first part and so they go right back in to this line again because this section is repeated twice. Okay so this part goes like this. So as you can see, I just went right off that last lick into it, repeated again. And so at the end of uh, the second time around that we play this, it goes into the last bars of the song. So this is kind of just as the song is fading off, um, what he's singing. And it goes D, E, F, C, then A, D, E, 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 D, C, D, E, F. E, C, D, E, F, C, E, D, E, A, G, F, E, D, E, F, C, A, C, and then I usually just end it off with a E at the end, which isn't on the sheet music. Um, and that goes like this. <laughs> So that's the end of the song. And then uh, the only part I didn't go over is the rap part. And uh, basically how I played it in my cover, which if you want to go check that out, uh, the link will be in the end slate, um, is just all G's. Basically you just follow along with the rhythm that he's rapping and it's all G's. Really not very complicated, but that's how I played it in the song. All right, well that's it. So thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like rating down below. It really helps. Also, uh, tell me in the comments down below what you want me to play next and maybe I'll do it. 
Also, don't forget to go follow me at at Trump underscore guy on Instagram so you can see what I'm doing outside of YouTube. I'll see you all next week.